Alright guys, it's time for a story. So back in October, there was this game mode in COD called Realism. It had no HUD, and all headshots were one shot. And the gameplay was a little bit slower, but it was more tactical. But not like too tactical, like Arma or anything. Just, you know, it was, it was just a nice little blend of tactical and casual. And you know, overall it was a lot of fun. There was also this other mode called NVG. It contained night maps. Four of the base game's maps had night variants that took place at either dawn or dusk, and most of the areas in those maps were pitch black. So in order to see, you had to use night vision goggles and everything. But because of that, it made things even slower and more tactical. There were times where you felt like you were taking part in a night raid. Well, you know, without the real life consequences and everything behind it. People complained about it being too dark, but like, you know, that was the fucking point. So eventually Infinity Ward made NVG part of their realism playlist. And I mean, I at the time I didn't really care. I was like, oh, there's only four maps anyways. It's whatever. It fits realism anyways. So for a couple months, realism, NVG and the rest of the game lived in harmony. But everything changed when Shipment and Shoot House arrived. By nature, these two new maps were extremely attractive. They were smaller maps that guaranteed kill counts of up to 100 or so. So like naturally everyone flocked to them. At the time, there was no guarantee that these 24-7 playlists of these maps would ever return. So of course, everyone wanted to get the challenges out of the way. The problem was, Infinity Ward decided to take out Realism at around the same time, which was around, you know, January. And I was like, oh, maybe they just wanted to rotate it out for a bit and then they'll bring it back for, you know, for whatever odd reason. And of course, I was being overly optimistic. And I went on Reddit and I was like, hey, Infinity Ward, it would be kind of cool if you got some, some new night maps. And, I, and at the time, a decent amount of people agreed. Nobody really disagreed with it. But perhaps I was a little too optimistic. Not only have we not gotten more night maps, but also realism returned for the first time in four months, two weeks ago. That is absurd. How did a mode that was advertised so much for months become a barely rotated game mode? I mean, it clearly wasn't a player count issue, right? Because it, it still takes me just as much time fighting matches as it does in other modes, like whenever Realism returns. But then it hit me. They took it out because of me. Because I'm fucking disgusting at this mode. I am the epitome of greatness when it comes to Realism. I will drop 40, 50, 60 burgers on these motherfuckers on the regular. Nobody stands a fucking chance against me. Nobody can fucking compete. I listen to Captain Price and I check my corners. I listen to Thanos and I aim for the head. I am absolutely unstoppable. You cannot call me stopping power because my power cannot be stopped. Infinity Ward is scared. They are scared for everybody else. That's why they keep taking it out. They don't want to see me demolish these hoes. They don't want to see me drop 40 something kills in a match while everybody else barely hits like 20. This is a formal apology video to the realism community, but nobody should be punished for my actions. We need to stand together, and we need to let Infinity Ward know that we want this to be in the game permanently again, and for it to be supported in future Modern Warfare titles. Infinity Ward devs, if any of you are bored enough to the point where you are watching this, please add more night maps to the game. Like vacant with like a full moon aesthetic, or sawmill with the fires going around on the in the barn, or even superstore or or shipment just for the sake of it. In all seriousness, this is a great addition to the franchise, and it really should be supported going forward. In games where it makes sense to have this, like modern type games, this is fantastic. If you are short of level designers to make night maps, I'll do it, literally, for free. I have experience with lighting work, and you guys aren't even working in the studio anyway. So we can make this long distance thing work. That's all I have for you guys today. You know, I, I will see you in the next one. But if realism ever returns, uh, play it.